Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting and reading to episode 10 of the Many Sides of Voice Actor Radio. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Yay! Uh oh. Mm -hmm. Right? Don't overthink it. You can still ask. Mm. See, okay. Even though, because see, it seems like she's still struggling. But at the same time, she shouldn't really overthink it and stuff. She's she's not like how she was two episodes ago. Deadass. So, once again, she's improved from last week to this week. But, of course, yes, just as much as anybody else would. We have moments where we definitely question, like, was that good enough? Was this good enough? What else do I need to do to make myself better? And that's okay. I even... I do it too. I, I do. There are times like, okay, where I um I say something and literally after I'm done recording or even while I'm still recording and after I said what I said, I like sit in the back of my mind. I'm like, was that the good thing? Should I have said that? I don't know. Should I have worded it like this instead of this? Like, it, but the thing is, it's just some people are going to agree with you and some people are going to disagree with you. And the ones who disagree with you is, it is what it is. But if everyone else said she did fine, then you did fine. Even though you got to do retakes, it'll be okay. Oh, nice. <laughs> See, you say that. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
It's like, no one can know about that. <laughs> oh, come on. Yeah, I mean food. Food. The thing the things us girls will do for food. I don't think well Yeah, I'll take yeah. There's certain things I ain't gonna do for food, I'll tell you that. But if you buy me food, I'll be your friend. <laughs> Well, I mean, yeah, but your style is different. dog <laughs> Girl! That was sweet. <laughs> <That's a lie. laughs> that was cute. Oh, 
I mean, that makes sense. Like, as much as I wanted our girls to win. Hey, I'll tell my. Aww. You guys. Okay. What's wrong? <laughs> Aww. Just the cutest little date. That's all. <laughs> so cute. Yes, I mean, you're also wearing a cute outfit. I like the sweater top. I'm not always like a plaid looking girl, but plaid, because plaid looks good on me. It depends on what it is. If it's more like, mm, if it's plaid shorts, I love the shit out of plaid shorts, but pants, no. They look weird. Shorts, my essentially it's my legs, my my butt does so. <laughs> Honestly, yes, really. If you hadn't come, who knows what would have happened. Enjoy that apple juice, babe. And our couple.
Yeah, Yasumi knows what she's doing. Oh, that look good. They look like one of those um kava salad bowls. Are you okay? Oh, you just drunk. Oh my God, girl. That's a good question, yeah. There's a possibility, yes. Yeah, Yuri is definitely with her. Everyone's there with her. But I think it's because she's so still, like, stressed about all these other big paying you actors with her. It, 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 it's a little like, oh my god, like, damn, can I do this? But we've proven that she's done. She's proven that she does! And that she can, but it's still, you know, she has moments. Mm-hmm. 
And also, it might be the grating. Okay. It is a little stressful for God to me. I, I mean, if I was in that, I know, like, this is a life or death situation. Of course, it's a very important episode. And this is her one pivotal moment to take everything that she's learned, the criticism that she's gotten from the directors, the voice directors, anyone in general, the good and bad. And to take everything that she has learned and, like, be like, okay, I can do this. If I can do this, I can do anything. Even with the fact is, like, yes, asking your, <laughs> your senpais for, like, some advice. I really love the fact that she was able to do that. But at the same time, um, even your senpais don't even have, like, the best answer there's nothing wrong with that but this is the ultimate test for her but in the end she's gonna have to ask you know her bff slash girlfriend like hey what should i do like i need a little bit of notes and stuff it's just complicated and, and i hope by next week when we get to this pivotal voice recording of this highly anticipated uh, important episode that she is able to get through it that there is no retakes for her but I can't imagine pretty much for anybody in the voice acting industry. I do not like the thumbnail for episode 11 already. God damn. Come on now. You can't give me one good thing of hope. Oh, uh, God. Next is going to be a tear jerker. I just, I, I know it. I just fucking know it. Oh, Nasu. Honey, oh my god, my coconut, baby. How far? Oh my god. Um, I can't imagine as a voice actor even in America versus a voice actor in Japan where you have to stay back and do a retake after retake after retake. Even when you're thinking like, okay, everything I do, you know, you think that is like the top is of your tier and stuff. But once again, we are our biggest critiquers, truly. Like I said, I anything I say in any of my videos, anything that I say um, while I am live streaming and such, I, I literally always have to be like, after I go back and like I'm done, and I go and sometimes look. I don't do it for like every single one of my videos, but like for recently with my live stream videos, I will like go back and like, because of course with the shorts and everything, if there's a moment, like you see from like not... Not this past stream, but the stream beforehand, I didn't do anything because I was talking about really important shit that I was like, I'm not putting this out. I was like, I don't want to put that out there, no. Um, there's some things that I'll say, and I'll be like, why the fuck did I say that? Or like, why did I say it like that? Or we're like, mm, and such. But then there are some things I cannot say when I'm under a mic and stuff because it, it some things could be a little controversial and stuff um, or mean and stuff. And, you know, some people don't want to 
you know, deal with things like that. I, I've seen people where, like, I, I've, I've always told people, like, no matter what, when you come into my stream and stuff, or even if you come into my videos, or even if you just talk to me, it is a safe place. You can tell me certain things, and, you know, between it'll always be between me and you. It won't be between me, you, and someone else. And that's the same thing how I say vice versa and stuff. If I say something under my stream and let's say I take it to like my Instagram, my Snapchat, whatever. It's still the same thing and such. I'm still sharing it with other people who are so close and important to me, but you never really know. I don't want it to be like to the point of where like, okay, there's a lot of shit that's going down on Twitter with certain people and such. Not in the, um, not in like any YouTuber stuff, more of like, people who are in the gaming news that's currently what's happening in the last 12 to 24 hours and it's going very hectic um and it, it, it's not looking good for this person of what they did and stuff because the first thing they did was bad and then what they decided to do with their new stuff is even worse and so i'm just like maybe this is a sign for you to just not do anything anymore, not really go this route and stuff, but you know, just criticism. Moral of the story is criticism and biggest critic, but she is also her biggest supporter. So I think she has this next week, even despite with the thumbnail of the next episode, she's got this. I hope, but other than that, guys, oh, well, actually, no, I did like the um. The event. The event was good. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode 10 of the Many Sides of Voice Actor Radio. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all on Wednesday next week for episode 11. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.